Graham Burke Theatre's 14 Cine in Cape Girardeau hosts Sensory Saturday once a month for families with special needs children. The auditorium has the lights up, the sound turned down, and the audience can move about in a safe and accepting environment. In February of 2010, we actually started our first show of Sensory Saturday. Um, we have them every third weekend of every month now. It's on Saturday at 10 a.m. You know, through those programs, we're able to leave the lights fully lit so it's not so dark that it scares the children. Um, the house lights, you know, they're half halfway down. Uh, the volume is left at a normal level. We turn it down. Uh, when the movie starts, we actually turn it off and we get it to the right level to where the people in the auditorium can enjoy the movie without having it to be scary or overbearing because of any disability that they have. Sensory Saturday was something that I had heard of in Columbia, Missouri that was going on and I thought would be interesting for kids and families in this area. There was I talk to a lot of families and we do community outings and one of the concerns was that you know, they'd like to take their kids to the movie but they weren't able to and, or they were nervous, they were scared, you know, what would happen. And so when I saw the Sensory Saturday, I thought that would be a great opportunity to have down here. Leanne Hopper, uh, autism uh, professional, uh, asked me to to help her start a uh, Century Saturday movie, talking to Kevin, uh, Kevin Dillon, the manager here at the Westport Cine. And uh, from then, there we started it up. Uh, Mike already had a, a, a team of people, families that he had email addresses for, and um, they had talked about the movie you know, whether they would want to show movies for the families. With this program, the family can come out, they can enjoy it, the kids, the adults can make noise, get up, walk around, move around as much as they want to. Sensory Saturday has grown. The number of families that participate has only increased and the theater has done a great job picking movies that really attract a high number of people. We not only have individuals with autism coming to these um, Sensory Saturday events, but we have families with all sorts of disabilities and kids that again would typically not have this experience if it weren't for Weirenberger Theaters and the folks who initiated that. I had hesitated to take Emma to the movies, uh, to regular uh, shows, but because of her behavior, we were afraid we would have to leave or that she would uh, disturb other people in the movie. So we love the freedom of Sensory Saturday, the, the tolerance if she does get up and dance or sing or those kind of, kind of things, um, that, that that's welcome and, and that it's okay and, and we can stay and watch the movie. The uh, Missouri Senate actually gave us a proclamation because of the Sensory Saturday, um, and uh, which was a very nice gesture, um, just to recognize us for participating and uh, providing some type of uh, service here to where the families can actually bring their children or bring anybody with autism or other disabilities to the movies, which normally they may not have been able to do. Uh, but with this program, uh, you know, the Senate recognized us, gave us the proclamation, uh, which was a very nice gesture from them, and we very appreciated it very much. <laughs>